Hi guys, it's Sam and welcome back to another reaction video. So this video is the next part of the previous one, obviously, uh, of the listening party that I'm going, I'm, I'm doing right now of uh, the sound album. And right now I'm going to react to DLMLU, a song written. I mean, I think the lyric is written by Hyunjin, if I'm not mistaken. So. Let's see. By the way, I decided to do uh, this song, especially this song alone, uh, compared to the others, because uh, I saw a little bit of a spoiler um, during uh, when I was on Twitter, and it talked about flowers, and the lyric was really interesting. So. I, uh, I really wanted to talk about it, even though right now I don't know the lyric. I just know a tiny bit part. Why do camera I just in that angle? Anyways, so I just really wanted to focus on the song. So I hope it's worth it. Obviously, it's worth it, but whatever. So let's go. I put the lyric sign. Everything is perfect. Okay, three, two, one. It's really hot here. Oh my god. Wow. You know this this line makes you think of it makes me think of a quote uh something that uh, I think it's Tim Wilson said that I don't know where but around the line he said that you can despite um that the roses are thorns but you also can be uh, glad that uh, thorns are roses it makes me think of this I think it's a pretty uh, good quote because we have two uh, two faces when it comes to love two sides so I think yeah it makes me think of this quote so I just wanted to, to tell Wait, before I knew it, I was getting hurt as a half a links of poison in my relationship. It's it sounds kind of toxic to be honest, and to be one sided love or something, and. Some, somehow, it reminds me of, I don't know if you know, the um, it's a tale, a Japanese tale, called Hanaaki. Hana means flower, if I'm not mistaken, in Japanese, and the, the rest of, of the, the word I don't remember, I'm probably going to put here, means to throw up. And basically, Hanaaki is a fictional, obviously, fictional um, disease where if uh, it's a one-sided love and the person who don't say oh I love you back, don't love you back you're going to die by vomiting flower, uh, petals of flowers and it hurts and it's toxic but you can't you don't want to stop loving this person because, because this person is really you really like this person for some reason 
and you have two, cho two choices die after you vomit all these petals or just get a sur surgery where you take this love and then after the surgery you will not love this person anymore and forever yeah amazing or hanaki it's a really beautiful tale anyways you should look it up <laughs> Before the friend spray, the let me love you. Because I know you don't want the person to love you. I mean it's it's interesting. Wow, this part. Oh, the echo. Wow. Don't let me love you. Wow, okay. The, 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 the end of the song is completely opposite about the Hanaki. I mean, not quite opposite because, first of all, Hanaki is about the person who loves and is one side love. But you know, some in Hanaki, on many stories, when you include Hanaki, when, for example, me, I love someone and I say, oh, I love you, I really do love you, and the person says, like, I'm sorry. I, I, I can't say I love you back because it's not my feelings, it's not what I feel about you. The, the last part makes me think of the response and answer to the person that loves them. Like say, please don't love me because you're gonna get hurt. It's like a battle. I really like it. Um, and it's funny to me because uh, Hanaki is a Japanese fictional disease and <laughs> it's it's from a Japanese comeback so I, I think it's quite funny I mean not funny haha but yeah I think it's really interesting so yeah I'm really really happy about this it's really oh my gosh it's so pretty <laughs> oh my god Anyways, uh, thanks for watching. See you on the next part of the listening party, I guess. And go watch the previous one and see you.